New at 4.30, the mother of a Charlotte woman killed by a drunk driver on her wedding night is now in a legal battle with the man her daughter was supposed to spend the rest of her life with, and it's all over money. Queen City News anchor Morgan Francis has been following this story for months now. She's joining us in studio. So, Morgan, what's in this new lawsuit? Danny, this is all just so tragic. This is all coming from Lisa Miller, the mother of Samantha Miller. You may remember Samantha died on her wedding night riding in a golf cart that was hit by a drunk driver in Folly Beach. Now Lisa is trying to become the representative for Samantha Miller's estate and is suing her surviving spouse. Samantha died without a will, so her assets were passed on to Eric Hutchinson, and he was made the personal representative of the estate. Court documents state Lisa and her attorneys threatened to challenge the validity of Sam and Eric's marriage on the basis that the couple didn't spend the night together after the wedding. Eric the groom offered to give Miller half of the money if she stopped with the invalid marriage claims. Miller denied that request. Samantha was dead at the scene wearing her wedding dress and the three other passengers were taken to a hospital with serious injuries. Police reports show Jamie Komorowski was speeding while intoxicated when she hit the golf cart they were riding in. She was denied bond at a hearing over the summer. We will, of course, let you know if anything changes in Samantha's estate. Annie.